Hello everyone, and sorry for the delay. Um, just I was just busy with stuff. Um, I certainly wasn't playing Fortnite a lot, but anyway, I'm here, and I'm here to answer your questions for my third Q and A. And I'm reading the comments right now. And from how it looks, I've gotten seven comments. Now, I think my second one had more comments, but it makes me happy when you guys um comment a question or something. It it really makes me feel good. So, anyway, enough with the talking. On to answering. And like always, they're from oldest to newest. And I'm gonna start off with Cameron plays one two three four five. And he asks, "What do you use when you edit your videos?" I use iMovie. That's really it. <laughs> yeah, that's really all I can say. So I just use iMovie. I don't know what else I can say about it. From SSBM Brim, he or she asks. What do you think of Nintendo adding Ridley, King K. Rool, and Isabel to Smash Ultimate? Now, I am still really excited for this game, but sometimes the choices that Nintendo makes kind of anger me. Because people keep telling me this is going to be the final Super Smash Bros. game. And if it is, I kind of want them to go out big. And I know they're doing it, and I know lots of people are happy, but with some of this stuff, it kind of angers me. But that's just my opinion, so... With Ridley, that was one of the things that angered me. Like, you've had Ridley in previous Smash Brothers games, and he was very big, so you purposely shrink him down so he's playable. Like, I know people say Bowser and Donkey Kong and Charizard were bigger, but we never saw them beforehand. They just appeared, and they were there, so those were okay. This one, I don't know why it sets me off, but I think that's it. Now... King K. Rool, I think he was a good choice. I'm excited to play as him. Plus, we don't get a lot of Donkey Kong characters, even though I've never played a Donkey Kong game in my life, discluding the first one. And then Isabel, at first I kind of rolled my eyes, like, really out of all characters you pick Isabel, but after I saw her gameplay trailer, I think she can be a good fighter. And at first I thought she was going to be a clone character, a villager, which does seem like the lazy route, but... At least they give her some different moves to make her stand out. So yeah, still excited for Smash Ultimate. I even pre-ordered it, so just close to two months away. From Catburger, he or she asks, What do you mainly do in your free time? Do you play some games on Steam like Brawlhalla, or are you the type to read? <laughs> um, when I'm not making videos, um, I lay around, watch YouTube, um, go to school mostly play video games, and that's it, uh, when I'm off camera and not recording, I'm a bit of a lazy guy, but, but when it comes to school, I try not to be, <laughs> but, yeah, I play games, I haven't played Steam in a while, and I have played Brawlhalla, and then I never read, I only read when it's school related, <laughs> but yeah, it's just, I kind of lay around, watch YouTube, be lazy, and that's mainly what I do, from Astro Bevo, he asks, what do you think of My Hero Academia, and what's your favorite character? Um, I've never watched the show before. <laughs> For those who've watched my adult cartoons opinion discussion, I think I said that Pokemon and Agretsuko were the only animes I've ever seen, period. And if I haven't said that, I thought I did, but those were the only two animes I've ever seen, period. And I don't watch them, only Agretsuko, which I'm still so excited for season two, but I know friends who are into My Hero Academia, a lot of friends, so it doesn't interest me, but I'm not saying it's bad because I've never seen the show, but it's just I've never watched it, and I'm sorry, but I can't answer the favorite character question since I've never seen the show. <laughs> From Fireboy Pro, he or she asks, what do you think will happen if Nintendo and South Park were cancelled? Well, to start off, Nintendo can't get cancelled. They're a company, so they'd get bankrupt and would lose a lot of money and wouldn't make anything. So, I can't see that happening for a long time since, especially now, Nintendo seems at the top of their game. But, if they said we're going bankrupt and we're not making games anymore, I'd honestly be really upset because... No more Pokemon, no more Mario, no more Kirby, and 
I know people like Legend of Zelda, but those are the games that I really like. So I'd be really upset. And then if South Park were canceled. Now, I know there's that joke where it's hashtag cancel South Park, but I did hear for a while that the creators wanted only a few more seasons before ending, which I'd be upset if it ended because it's been on for so long and cons consistently too. It's not like Family Guy where... It got canceled a couple times and then brought back. No, it's been staying on for a long time. And I would be upset too, but not as upset as Nintendo. Because I think I said I've only mainly seen the older episodes. So I wouldn't be very upset if there's like no more new content. But I'd still be upset because it's South Park and it's been on for a very long time. And oh, hey, speaking of cancel South Park. What's with all the Cancel South Park ads? I'd say it's just a marketing stunt, like Trey Parker and Matt Stone are known for doing weird stuff, so I wouldn't take it very seriously. So, Plus they have a new season and it's still going on, so it could be a joke. I think it's a joke, but you heard my previous answer about if they did get canceled, so yeah, I think I basically answered that. And finally, from Christian Castellanos, I'm sorry if I pronounced it wrong, he or she asks, what's your opinion on Tomba and Tomba 2, The Evil Swine Return on PS1? I have never heard of that game before. <laughs> no, I've never, never heard of that game before. Like, I know what a PlayStation is. I know people who own one. I know a lot of games for the console. Just, I have never heard that one. I'm sorry, but... I cannot answer that one because I've never, ever heard of it before. Yeah, and those are all the questions. Uh, again, thank you all for commenting. I like it when I get a lot of comments. And tell me, if you guys want this to be a monthly thing, um, comment down below because then I'll probably try to do that and try to make it a bit more consistent. But that's if you guys want me to. If not, I'll just throw them out of nowhere when I feel like I want to, so, yeah, just comment down below if you want more, uh, thanks for watching, if you liked the video, don't forget to like, and consider subscribing for more content, and I'll see you guys in the next video, bye-bye.